Hello everyone, today we're going to be talking about NCSoft. Do you guys think NCSoft is running out of ideas? So if you guys may have noticed, the newest dungeon that just came out in Korea is exactly the same as Nehru Sanctum. So it's the same dungeon as Nehru Sanctum, it's just everything, all the difficulty, the HP, the damage you take has been bumped up. And you know, this has gotten a lot of people pretty worried because dungeons were kind of like the new highlight that we looked forward to every big update because it was like, oh look, we got a new dungeon, we got new mechanics, we got different, different things to do. And it was like a breath of fresh air. But with this new dungeon that came out in Korea, like it's exactly the same as Nehru Sanctum. There was no figuring out. It was just, oh, it's Nehru Sanctum. Just, you know, with the OG mechanics way back then where you had to do like clock positions and everything and everything would insta-kill you. So, I mean, I guess that's cool. But still, it's nothing new, right? So, do you guys think NCSoft is running out of ideas? Has Team Bloodlust like just kind of given up on developing new dungeons or maybe they're focusing on unreal engine 4 like i don't have any information about that so i don't know what exactly is going on like internally all i know is that the newest dungeon that came out is kind of like yeah on the korean servers like lucky for us on the na and eu servers we still got um after stone passage we still got like the big blob dungeon so uh, I, I don't know what to call it, the Zack dungeon, I guess. So that's pretty cool. I think that one has some pretty fun mechanics and the boss looks pretty funny. But after that, I'm not sure. I think that's it. Then we go to that Nehru Sanctum dungeon. I think that that's it. So, uh, you know, we've dungeon wise, we've only got two more dungeons to look forward to. And as for raids, well, you know, we've got that big raid coming up, the Iron Arc. So that's definitely going to take a while to sort through. We're going to have to sit there and uh, figure things out. And the DPS requirement is pretty insane. So there's that. Um, I don't actually know what's going to happen. Like, I'm kind of curious. Like, do you think NCSoft is finally out of ideas for Blade and Soul and they're just trying to cash out now? Or do you think that this was just like a band-aid solution because they're overworking Team Bloodlust on trying to make the Unreal Engine 4 actually good for the PC? So, you know, there's like two ways to look at it. We can look at it at an optimistic side, which is, okay, Team Bloodlust is working super hard on Unreal Engine 4. They're going to make it happen. They, they released the Frontier server, received a bunch of backlash, so they're actually going to take it seriously and try to fix it. You know, that's the positive side of things. Or we can look at the negative side of things where it's like yeah ncsoft is done you know they're going to release the mobile titles cash out on this title and then they're just going to close blade and soul right and they cash out they're done and then they close blade and soul and they move on to a next title ncsoft was going to attend e3 to showcase a new game but you know e3 was cancelled so unfortunately we don't exactly know what they were going to showcase but some people were hoping that oh you know maybe they'll showcase blade and soul console or the new blade and soul on unreal 4 engine or you know something blade and soul related but now we'll never know because e3 was cancelled but yeah i'm just curious to hear what you guys think on the whole situation of the new dungeon coming out being exactly the same as Nehru Sanctum but just harder it just I don't know it just kind of baffles me that they would reuse content like that I don't think they've ever reused content like even with like the Bloodshade Harbor and like the Pohoran dungeon and everything like they were similar but it was still unique enough or different enough that you know people are like okay you know these are different dungeons so, I don't know, man. I don't know. But anyway, that's it for me today. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, I would appreciate a subscribe. And I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye. What can I say except you're welcome for the heels, the 